हेलो यो बॉयस वेलकम बैक स्वागत है आप लोगों का एस एस एन क्रीड और ओडिसी के अंदर ओडिसी सॉरी ओडिसी के अंदर तो शुरू करते हैं बिना किसी बकचोरी के तो भाई दो यार बोलो देख रहे मगर सब्सक्राइब नहीं कर रहे लाइक नहीं कर रहे थिंग तो बहुत ही कंजूस चाले कर रहे भाई एक लाइक दे दिए तो क्या जाता रहे भाई तुम लोगों का हाँ वैसे अपन कहाँ थे तुम लास्ट वीडियो में देखे होंगे कि कैसेंड्रा उसके बाप के पास आती निकोलास द वुल्फ के पास उसको बाद बोट चढ़े बाद ही मालूम होता ना निकोलास उसका बाप है मतलब निकोलास उसका बाप है उसको पहले से मालूम है मगर वुल्फ निकोलास रहता बोल के नहीं मालूम है तो इट्स बेसिकली ये स्टोरी चलो शुरू करते हैं बिना किसी वक्त छोड़ी के उसके एक एडोप्टेड बेटे के साथ बात कर रहे थे अपन उसका नाम क्या था वो एक बार देख लेंगे क्लिप ठीक है The Athenian dog Pericles fears you. He cowers in his Parthenon, surrounded by playwrights and sophists. He dares not face you with honor on the battlefield. He knows you are too strong. He knows Athens' days in Margolis are numbered, and he knows Athens is next. <laughs> You, you destroyed the Athenian blockade. They were in my way. Sparta owes you thanks. Dichi has blessed you, my friend. You arrived in time to watch my pater achieve a glorious victory. If Nicolaus is your father. I guess that makes you my brother. Did you take a blow to the head during battle? What are you talking about? The wolf is my father as well as yours. Ridiculous! Before he adopted me into his home, he had two children, and they both died in Sparta many years ago. Except for the one standing before you now. You almost fooled me, but I wasn't born yesterday, Mistyos. Let's stick to the subject of why you're here. What is a mercenary doing sailing into a war they aren't being paid to fight in? Tell me why you're really here before I cut you down for wasting my time. I've come to meet the wolf of Sparta. <laughs> uh, you cannot simply meet with Nikolaos. He has command of the entire Spartan army. If you truly came all this way to meet him, you might be disappointed. Are you sure you're in charge here? You don't strike me as a typical Spartan. Perhaps it's best if I just talk with Nikolaos. A sense of humor is not a trait I see being useful for a Selsor. If you're here to earn drachmi, though. I could make use of a capable mercenary. The fleet might be destroyed, but Megaris is firmly in Athenian control. We need to weaken their position if we are to take to the field and drive them back to Athens.
How goes the war effort? The Athenian blockade was a desperate attempt to stop our advance through Megaris. Now we can prepare to drive them from this region once and for all. Our forward scouts are identifying key targets in preparation for our assault. Under the Wolf's command, we shall be victorious. Your father... who is he, exactly? Nikolaos, the Wolf of Sparta. He was impressed with my skill when I was a boy, and took me under his wing. He trained me himself, and eventually adopted me into his house. He is my father and mentor. I live to make him proud. Surely you've heard of him. Just rumors, really. I doubt they do him justice. He is a great warrior, and a greater general. I would follow him to the gates of the underworld. Why do you need a mercenary to do that? You seem to have plenty of soldiers at your disposal. It's not a question of manpower. The Megarians are our allies. We do not want to commit troops until we know victory is assured. My scouts are already locating key targets that we can hit. I'll help you rid Megaris of Athenians for a price. Typical of your type. No honor or sense of duty. But your skills are better serving us than our enemy. The Athenians already have a mercenary working for them. They don't need more help. If we can draw the leader out and eliminate him, we will crush the Athenians on the battlefield and drive their forces all the way back to Athens, destroying their supplies, stealing their war chest, and killing their elite troops should leave him vulnerable. Take this, and present it to my scouts. If you find them in the field, be sure to check for new information. They might also have need of your skills. This chest you want me to steal, why is it so important? An army is made of men that need pain. Take away the drachmi and they lose all the will to die for other men's ambitions. The Athenians keep their treasure well guarded in the fort at the foot of Mount Yerania. What supplies should I destroy? Anything the Athenians need. Look for crates of supplies and weapons. The port of Nicaea in the valley of King Lelech would be a good place to start. It's where their supplies come into the region. Where is the Athenian leader? He is in Megara, hiding behind stone walls and a full garrison of troops. But if you kill his troops, destroy his supplies, and steal his riches, then he'll be open to attack. I think I know what must be done. Remember, every Athenian soldier you eliminate will also help us achieve victory. And once I've brought the okay. to their knees for Sparta, I'll get that meeting with Nikolaos. Okay, by Jandi Orkita Volpius. Sure they to Do this, and the wolf will personally see to it that you are rewarded. Okay, conquer nation to meet your father nation. Okay. Make a father <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> nation power, okay. Mera piche bounty hunter pada hai bhai ek. Okay. I'll have to help okay, okay. So guys, Abhi center bola tha apunku Athenians ke leader ko marne ka hai general. Kya naam hai uska? Kuch naam bola tha uska. I didn't remember that. So, dekhing ab. Aise ine adopted beta hai unhe. Uske matlab. उसका अडॉप्टेड मतलब अडॉप्टेड बेटा ही बोल रहा ना भाई अब भी थोड़ी देर पहले उन्हें बोला ना कि मैं निकोलास को निकोलास मेरे को अडॉप्ट करे बोल के तो उसके बच्चे और बीवी मर गए बोल के वो आ था मतलब अम्मा भी मर गए बोल के नहीं मालूम था मेरे को जरूरत नहीं है भाई ना ओ तो अभी ये सिक्का मिशन है यहाँ पे लोकल मिशन है चल देखिए क्या काटेंगे आरोप देखते हैं बाद में 
I'm a professional and a friend. But what's that supposed to mean? If it had been me, I'd have been smart enough to try and hide the evidence. <laughs> Fair point. Whoever did this was brazen and foolish, leaving it to be so easily discovered. Or they wanted to send a message. Stentor sent me. I'm here to help wherever I can. Stentor sent you? Sparta doesn't fully control Megaris yet. It's easier for me to move freely in certain areas of Megaris than a Spartan. The Athenians have proven more resilient here than expected. But they will Before not stand. Before Sparta, yes. I've heard the speeches. But until that glorious day comes, we should find out what happened here. Do you have any ideas? Not yet. But I will. I should get a closer look to figure out what happened here. These were professional soldiers. Slaughtered to a man. I don't think bandits could have done this. The supplies are missing. They can't have gone far, though. They didn't use the carts. Looks like they went this way. Into the forest. I don't think I'll find anything else. I should report back. So, was it the Athenians? I found some fragments of a green crystal. Bandits, then. The mountains here are riddled with caves, and the war has made them brazen. If it was Athenians, they would have taken the carts as well as the supplies. And bandits? They wouldn't have stood a chance against trained Spartans. What are you saying? I'm not sure. Whoever did this went into the forest. So I'll start by looking there. There they are! being cooked near here. Is this a private gathering? Or can anyone join? What? What are you? Please! Please just leave! You don't look like murderers. Was that the Spartans' mistake? What? Wait! No! Please! You don't understand! What's to understand? It all seems perfectly clear. Please! Let me plead our case! You'd better tell me why I shouldn't just kill you and return the goods. Please! I'll tell you anything you want to know. You're the sorriest band of thieves I've ever seen. By the gods, no! We're citizens of Megara! Please, show mercy! This war has already cost us dearly! Like the mercy you showed those Spartan soldiers? I... we... we just took some food. Irkanos told us to take it, said he'd make it easy for us. Irkanos? Yes, the mercenary. He said he'd provide food. Told us the Athenians would never let their people go hungry. Explain yourselves. It's not wise to anger the Spartans. Please, we're not thieves. 
This is our food, our crops. They took it, left us with nothing. Our children are starving. Ah, so you repay theft with murder. A fine lesson for your children. Murder? No! Please, we never harmed anyone. Uh, Misty was told us where to find the food. Everyone was already dead. Enough! I didn't come here for a debate. It's too late for talk now. I came to find who's behind this crime against Sparta. Stand aside. You don't need to die today. I'm returning the supplies to the Spartans. Then you will do so over our dead bodies. Don't be stupid. Take some of the food, enough to get by. I'll say I killed you and claimed what was left. They will be satisfied. But the food! What of our families? Your families will not benefit from your death. Accept my offer and don't steal again. It won't be me who comes for you next time. Yes, Mistios. Thank you. Hurry, take what you can carry and go. Quick! Thank the gods they didn't try to fight. I wasn't in the mood to kill starving civilians today. Did you find the ones responsible? I found your supplies... ...with a bunch of hungry Megarians. And? You stole that food from them. They were starving. The supplies were essential for the war and ridding Megara of the Athenians. Hungry Megarians are the least of your worries. But there's something else. Have you heard of a mercenary called Irkanos? Irkanos? Yes, he's working for the Athenians. So the rumors go. This is all his doing. These mercenaries are persistent, I'll give them that. You've done well here, but if you really want to help Sparta, I have a task for you. What did you have in mind? Hunt him down. Show him that no mercenary dog will interfere with Sparta's plans. Since you have such a high opinion of mercenaries, why even send me? I'm sorry. It's just this man, Irkanos, is like a thorn in our foot. He's a menace to all Spartans here. Please, will you help us? I'll do it. If he's this much trouble, I take it there's a sizable reward. Of course. Just think of how much he'll have on him with all the drachmi Athens has given him to thwart our plans. I suppose you're right. Any idea where to start looking? He could be anywhere. Most likely, he's nestled up close to the Athenians. We've sent out a couple of patrols, but they never returned. And we can't spare any more men at this time. Sometimes you're better sending a woman anyway. Oh, I never taken that.
Come on. So this is what war looks like. Not what the stories make it out to be. The capital, Megara. If the leader's anywhere, he'll be here.
στον Ελληνικό Ράστα. Sambrahmi, you there? You have a kind soul. Help an old man buy his next meal. You need it more than me. Here, take it. A generous gift. Thank you. What do they call you, stranger? I'm Cassandra. And you? Just a simple beggar. I sailed from Persia to see the beauty of the Greek world. I can do many things, Persian, but I can't restore sight. Nor would I want you to. My blindness is a burden that the gods have given me to carry, and I will. Then what? Be my eyes. When I was a boy, an Athenian told me the most beautiful tales of your lands. I would love to hear them again. Would you go see the places I never was able to, and return to tell me the tale of your adventures? I'm not much of a storyteller, but I will be your eyes. I knew I sensed kindness in you. You've made this old Persian happy again. Don't thank me yet. What places do you wish you could have seen? Ah, my favorite tales were always of the Acrocorinth. The statues of Zeus in Athena, the perch of the armored bird in Arcadia, and of course, the mysterious mount Daigetos. So, tell me what you know about the statue of Zeus. Its great boat stood ready to punish the Kefalonians below. Or so I was told. I've seen Kefalonia from the statue of Zeus. Tell me, is it still a place of great beauty? Its people are the happiest in all the Greek world. They sing and dance into the night with full bellies and... Full hearts. That isn't how it was described to me at all. The tales go that its lands are among the world's most beautiful, and its people among the most pitiful. Okay, I've told you what I remember. Now tell me about yourself. What's a Persian doing here? Persia and the Greek world are doomed to be opposites. In times of prosperity here, Persians always seem to suffer. And when you're at war with yourselves... Persians? No peace? Indeed. My people prospered after King Xerxes was murdered. All except for me. A man tried to kill me with poison, which is how I lost my sight. I fled and arrived here. I find it hard to believe anyone would want you dead. You're very kind. Tell me another tale, then I'll tell you more of my past. What do you remember about this armored bird in Arcadia? There's a beast made of armor jutting out from the mountainside overlooking Lake Stymphalos and the undulating fields stretching like waves on a golden sea all across Arcadia. There are many statues to Athena. Which one do you mean? In my mind, there is only one. A story always began. As we rounded the hilltops, we could see Athens bustling below us, and Athena above. 
matching our gaze. The Acrocorins? Don't tell me. It's in Corinthia. Smart guess. It is the most renowned temple to Aphrodite, your goddess of all life's most pleasurable trivialities. You did say Mount Tayetos, didn't you? You sound like you know that place. I have heard tales of its appetites. They say the mountain feeds on the suffering of Spartans, so the people there offer their own children to the mountain god for sacrifice. That's... that's not exactly right. I'll be back with stories to tell. As soon as you've seen one location, please return. This papyrus is so old. Could this be writing by Themistocles?